Welcome to Crux Stationalis, the Roman Station Church Network. Here at Crux Stationalis, I take you with me as I journey through the streets of Rome. Today we head to the Roman Basilica of Santa Croce in Jerusalem. Santa Croce in Jerusalem, or the Holy Cross in Jerusalem, is the Roman Station Church for the second Sunday of Advent. It is a few steps down the road from St. John Lateran, the Cathedral of Rome. Before we head inside, don't forget to subscribe to Crux Stationalis, like this video, and when you're done watching, share it with your family and friends. Now, let's go see the relics of the Passion of Jesus Christ. According to tradition, the Basilica was consecrated around the year 325 to house the relics of the Passion of Jesus Christ, brought to Rome from the Holy Land by Empress Helena, mother of the Roman Emperor Constantine I. The relics are housed in this chapel. The entire complex of the Basilica sits upon soil from Jerusalem. That is the reason we consider the Basilica to be in Jerusalem. The relics found in this chapel are a true relic of the cross, as well as the Titulus Crucis, the symbol we see on crucifixes with the I-N-R-I. Also, we find two thorns of the crown of thorns, a part of a nail of the crucifixion, and the index finger of St. Thomas the Apostle. We might expect the station to be held at Holy Cross in Jerusalem on the third Sunday of Advent, since Gaudete Sunday, as it is often called, is the Advent parallel of Laetare Sunday in Lent. On the latter, the station is indeed kept there. Instead, the Church of Rome visits the relics of the true cross already on the second Sunday, perhaps as the blessed Idolfans Schuster writes, to remind us that Christ came as man so that he might die as a man for our salvation. In many Roman station churches, we find a union of two holy cities, Jerusalem and Bethlehem, depicted in the apsidal mosaics, where they are placed on opposite sides at the lowest part, a tradition begun in the mosaics of St. Mary Major. We find the same in this apsidal fresco of the Holy Cross in Jerusalem, entitled The Finding of the True Cross by St. Helena. It was created in the later 15th century, and the artist kept the very ancient Roman tradition of showing the two holy cities on either side of the work. The station for this Sunday in Advent is referred to in the introit of the Mass. O people of Zion, behold, the Lord will come to save the nations. Zion being, of course, another name for Jerusalem. And likewise in the communion antiphon, a rare citation of the prophet Baruch. Arise, O Jerusalem, and stand on high, and behold the joy that shall come to thee from thy God. At matins of the same Sunday, five of the nine responsories refer to the holy city of our Lord's Passion, three of them speaking to it as a person, such as this, the first. Jerusalem, thy salvation shall swiftly come. Why art thou consumed with grief? Hast thou no counselor, that thy sorrow is renewed in thee? I will save thee and deliver thee. Fear thou not, for I am the Lord thy God, the Holy One of Israel, thy Redeemer. Take these words today as consolation as you prepare for the coming of our Savior Jesus Christ. Thank you for joining us at today's Roman Station Church. We'll see you next time at Crux Stationalis, the Roman Station Church Network.